I've just had a demonstration of this new technology from a company called Neurosky that uses this piece of equipment that I'm wearing on my head to register your brain waves and then it uses those brain waves to control what's happening on the screen. Now there are several applications of this uh, including the detection of early signs of Alzheimer's and the treatment of ADHD but also there are some gaming applications. I've just had a go at an archery game where I had to either relax or focus my attention to hit the target. I wasn't very good at that one. Uh, we've seen similar technology on some children's games recently where the more you focus the higher you can raise a, uh, a ball on a jet of air. Uh, I also played another game which kind of suggests a new direction that uh, TV or film could go. It was a choose your own adventure style film. It was quite an aggressive one, it was called Dodge Bullets and what I had to do in certain situations I had to relax to uh, fend off my aggressor. But it was uh, really good fun, it uh, took a bit of concentration but it could be a, a new direction for TV. So the question is, would you want to sit with one of these on your head so you have the ability to be able to change the direction of a plot of a TV program? Uh, it's certainly different from relying on what the uh, director's provided you with. Of course, there are all the different endings that the director has to create, but uh, it's an interesting question. So if you want to get involved in a discussion and have your say about whether this technology is good and its potential, just go to www.witchconversation.co.uk.